Hi everyone. During this short video I would like to share an article with you that I found in the latest edition of the International Journal of Prostodontics. The article is a case report that describes the treatment of a pedodontic patient with dentinogenesis imperfecta. Dentinogenesis imperfecta is a condition that affects 1 in 8,000 people. Patients have an opalescent dentition and suffer from severe tooth wear, often resulting in a rapid loss of video, the vertical dimension of occlusion. The described case is a seven-year-old patient. Her chief complaint was the discoloration of the teeth and the rapid wear. Intraorally, we can see the mixed dentition and very often in these cases we see bulbous teeth and cervical constrictions as well as obliterations of the pulp chambers. In this case, so what did they do for this girl? First of all, they tried to scan intraorally, but the scanning failed due to the glossy aspect of the exposed dentin. So the dentist went to normal impression procedures. They recorded the video, increasing this with six millimeters. All this was digitalized in the lab. And after approval during the trial procedures, the definitive prosthesis was milled in PMMA. The authors discuss that this is a valuable treatment option that is especially useful in young patients because you can postpone definitive treatment. And the milling in the PMMA allows for a very thin prosthesis with good mechanical properties, although this is something that needs to be researched in the long term. This is the patient with the final prosthesis. I would say a valuable treatment option for similar cases.